Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to show you exactly what the SWU087 wig from the bestlacewig.com company looks like. And here is the package that it came in. And it is a number 2 and a 14 inch since I don't like long wigs. And it came with two wig caps which were brown, which were good. And now I'm just going to show you exactly what it looks like straight out of the package. The curls don't really look exactly what I thought they would look like, or I should say waves, but really they never look that way until you wash them and do what you have to do with them. So there are baby hairs around this wig, and they're fairly long, you know. I think I'm indifferent to baby hairs at this point, you know. They're kind of just there for me. Um, that's what the inside of the wig looks like. It is a lace front. It is not a full lace wig. And um, I guess that's just how they chose to sew the tracks. And I got the 09 one. I think that's the one you have to get to get the adjustable straps and the combs. And um, that's the color of the lace. It has three combs in the front. And I always use the side ones. And it pretty much has three inches of parting. I never use the middle comb because I don't really have a use for it. But that's pretty much what it looks like. And now I'm showing you what it looks like when I put some shampoo and some cold water in a bucket after I have brushed it out and detangled it. So the shampoo I use is the wet and wavy one. I just got it from the beauty supply. And it's supposed to be good for wigs and weaves and I just use my Tresemme Moisture Rich because I ran out of my wig shampoo and conditioner. Just Well I guess just my conditioner. But that's pretty much what the hair looks like when it is conditioned. And when I wash it out, that's what it looks like right here. A little bit of frizz. And what I do is I just put my spray on leave-in conditioner. As you see here, it kind of brought it to life a little bit. And redefined the curls. And I am not patient, guys. I cannot wait for a whole day for a wig to dry. So literally what I do is plop it inside my dryer. And I stand the dryer up so that... It's not dripping everywhere and I just leave so it there for a half the hour. The next day after I have washed it and done everything I can and when I put it in my dryer I used this leave-in conditioner which is the same brand as the shampoo and the conditioner which I ran out of and um, I just kind of relaxed the curls a little bit because what I was looking for was a wavy look. Now I will have to admit that when I bought this I was I don't know why I picked this one. I wanted something that was a, a bigger wave, but I am still very satisfied with this because I like the way the the, the waves hang. Like I like it, and um, yeah, it's exactly. It's a really cute wig. I really do like it. Tell me what you guys think. I think I think it's cute. Now I haven't done anything to the front, I haven't glued it down. I am going on vacation this week so I will probably glue it down. I will say though that after I washed it the wig shrunk a little bit, I think because it fits weird on my head now and I had to use the adjustable straps even though like I only washed it, that's all I did. But I will be fixing the stuff with the hairline but for now I'm gonna go to work with this on as long as the part looks okay which I think it does check out the part it looks really good um, as long as the part looks okay for me I'm not really lifting my hair or doing any of those things and usually what I do is I just put two bobby pins right here just to make sure that it is on tight and I have these two combs up so this is what the wig looks like I'll show you the back and the side I think it looks beautiful and I am a satisfied customer. Yes, yeah, so far so good. I really like this wig right now so I will wear it and give you guys an update. Until next time, I'll see you guys on my next video. Thank you so much for all of you guys who have subscribed to me and are watching my videos and I love to hear your feedback and all your comments. See you guys! Okay guys, so I pretty much forgot to give you guys all the details of this. I pretty much copied this from my invoice. This is exactly all the information I used to order my wig. But I call this more of a first look because I'm going to test this out. I'm going to straighten it. I'm going to braid, do braid outs. I'm going to curl it. And um, I'm going to come back to you guys in approximately two weeks and tell you exactly how the hair is holding up. The only issue I have is the fact that the cap size is too light, 
but make sure that you measure your head just just so that you don't end up with a cap that's too small because I heard that that's very possible with this company but anyway I'm rambling too much I'll see you guys in my next video if you have any questions please don't hesitate to let me know shoot me a message until next time I'll see you guys and stay blessed